What's up guys, Corvus95 here and welcome to episode 9 of my Manchester United career in Football Manager 2016. So, in the last episode we managed to win the Capital One Cup final. If you haven't seen it, it was a pretty good game against Man City, our rivals. And yeah, in this episode we are playing the second leg of our Champions League first knockout round game against PSG. We lost the first leg 1-0 at Stade de France um, but now at Old Trafford I'm hopeful we can get like a 2-0 win something like that or even a 1-0 I'd be happy and take it to penalties so yeah this is the team so far this is the team for the game got full strength team apart from Schweinsteiger's out so we've got Herrera filling in and everyone else is pretty much standard. Martial, Memphis, Rooney, Mata, Schneidlin, Herrera, Shaw, Smalling, Jones, Damian and De Gea. So yeah, I'll join you in the game guys. See you then. Okay guys, we are in the game against PSG. Where are the black and red? They're the blue and red. And hopefully we can pull out a win here. We need to if we're going to progress in the Champions League. Okay, so Shaw on the wing. Schneiderlin. Shaw again. Can you slide through? They have a lot back. Memphis. Memphis. Come on, couldn't say it. Has a shot. Blizzles, blazes it over the bar. I don't know what my mouth did there. If that had been on target, I think it would have went in. Sirigu was nowhere to be spotted. Right. It's a pretty dead first half, nothing really happening, two shots each. Ibra picks up a little bit of a knock. Right, come on lads. Don't look like a team that wants to win. We need a victory here. I don't really know what to do. Because it's just no highlights. Right, Memphis crosses in. Memphis again. Passes it over to Jones. Jones, can you do anything? Yes, feeds through Matter. Matter. Jones! Oh, if that had felt in Matter on the edge of the box, it might have gone in there. Instead of Jones. I mean, Jones isn't a bad player on this game. I remember, I think it was either Football Manager 14 or Football Manager 15, and he turned into one of the best centre backs in the world, which was ridiculous. But. <laughs> It was fun because I was England manager on that save. And yeah, he was basically Terry slash Ferdinand's replacement and was captain after like the third season or something like that and then stayed captain for like 10 years as we went on to win the World Cup. I'll have to see if I still have that save. Because I think he became England's record appearance maker. Right, we're 70 minutes in, we need to go more attacking. So we're going to bring on Yanazai for one matter. We're going to bring on Gabriel Barbosa for Martial. And that's all we'll do for now. Yeah, that's all we'll do for now. Right, come on lads, we need a goal. Definitely need a goal. Damian into Schneiderlin. Schneiderlin to Herrera. Herrera over to Memphis. Memphis has been quite influential in this game. Gabriel in the centre. Herrera. Yanazai. Yanazai. Can you do something? Yanazai scores! Yes. Come on, Yanazai. Substitution makes all the difference. Within two minutes, we've been by far the better team in this match. And we just need to either hold on to this lead and go to penalties or... If we can sneak in our goal, then we can get through. Surigu should be saving that. I don't know what he's trying to do there. Ibra's amazingly still on despite picking up the knock to his shin. Pretty painful. I mean, but Ibra doesn't need to use his feet to score. Okay, they have a chance. I don't like how they seem to get a chance and... When the AI gets like one chance and they've had hardly any chances the whole game, 
They usually skull. <gasps> Dear, how did you save that? Oh, we got so lucky there. Alright, Ferrati pick number yellow. They, they're on a breakaway. Shaw to Herrera. Herrera. Twist, uh, through to Gabriel. Gabriel scores. Ooh. Could have scored there. Right. Giannazai crosses in. To Jones. Out to the edge of the box. Rooney. Memphis is good. Rooney. Come on, Rooney. you captain for a reason. Do something. No. Stop feeding the ball back to them. Right, good. Damian to Herrera. I look very weak here. Come under here. Right, Memphis. To Gabriel. Gabriel, shoot. Oh. Damian. Can you get across it? Herrera to Rooney. Rooney turns, passes to Memphis. Memphis, Memphis. Oh, good attempt. Memphis needs to learn how to score, though. I think I'm going to have to work on his composure in the rest of the season. Shaw on this wing now. Rooney gets it tackled by Matuidi. This could be bad. It could be about to break and score. I mean, it could be the end of the game highlight, but it seems like it's a pretty long highlight if that's the case. Over to Gokan. Ibra. Ibra. Still got the ball. Tackle by Jones. Jones has got sent off. Why did I have to mention Jones being amazing? Phil Jones. Why? Well, Diego Reyes is going to come on for... I think we'll have to drop Rooney. Can't. I don't want to drop Rooney, he's been really good. I think we'll have to drop Herrera and bring Diego Reyes back, of course, and then swap those two around. Just calm. Come on, lads. Just hold on. It's the end of the game. See, when you get a red card, sometimes it does this and it takes forever for them to take the free kick. Verratti, through a small lane. That should be the end of the game. Right, it's going out into extra time. Right, we need a better team talk than that. I love it when you get this one, you end up bad, but you can still improve, because it always cheers them up. Unless they've played like a 9.7, and it's like, well, I can't improve boss. I, I, I can't really improve on perfection. Although once I did say it to someone who got a 10 in the first 90 minutes, and they were still happy. Okay, they've just dominated us. Right, we need to sort that out. Ibra has scored his 24th goal of the season against us. Aggressively, demand more. Should have done tight enough before the goal went in. That was a mistake on my part. Although Zayek shouldn't be getting through that easily. Ibra out jumps everyone. I can't really complain though. It's Ibra. Right, come on lads. We need a goal. Schneiderlin to Rooney. Can Rooney get forward to Memphis? Memphis has played a very good game apart from him, him missing his chance. Memphis still got the ball to Yanazai. Through to Memphis. Memphis! Come on, Memphis! Is he onside? He's onside! Memphis is 15th goal of the season. I can't believe he's got that many. Whenever we, whenever we play these live matches, he just misses goals. Like crazy, but... He slots this one away very nicely past Sirigu. 
that actually looked like a goal that could happen in real life. Sergu dived the right way. He dived with purpose as well. I don't believe... Ex does extra time goals count? Yes, it does. So we need to score again. Or else we're still going out. Well, oh, it's waiting for me to click this. Right, let's see tactics-wise. Um... Let's move Schneidel in a bit. And let's... We still need to go for it. Show some passion, lads. I want one where it's like... I want you to attack... With your all. But if... They... But also... Oh no. Come on. I missed that entirely, the fact that it's already the 120th minute. Those 15 minutes just shot by. That's the end of the game, and we're out the Champions League. Yay. I should have been paying attention. I mean, I don't think there was very, anything I could do there. Come on, lads. Full time. We're out of the Champions League. <sighs> Should have won that match. Geeks, you're wrong to sell us not to be harsh on them. They responded well to me being harsh. Very disappointed in you for getting sent off. I am. You got sent off in like the 90th minute. There was no point. We're out of the Champions League at this point. With three million, I'm finding you a week's wages. I don't care. I'm finding you a week's wages because I'm sick of people getting sent off. Yeah, you should be happy. You should be happy for me to find you. You should be giving me 10 weeks wages for getting sent off in a, such an important match. So now we're out of the Champions League. Not great, but at least we won the match. I'm happy with that. It was good performance. Memphis was a star player in that match. You may know I've got man of the match. No, Herrera did really well as well, apparently. But in the highlights we got shown, Memphis was standout. So I will see you for the Aston Villa match in a minute, guys. Right, guys, so going into the Aston Villa game, I've rotated nine of the players in the team. Timo Horn's now in goal for De Gea. Rojo and Reyes will make up the back two. Damian and Cho keep their places because I don't really have a replacement in left or right back. I probably need to get a new one. Um, Zuccolini and Diakite are making up the midfield. I don't know if I've mentioned Diakite at all. We signed him from Fiorentina. He's a youth prospect, 17 years old now. Pretty good all-round stats. Has pretty high potential as well. Um, Zivkovic is playing on the right. Got Jesse Lingard in the centre. Yanzai on the left. Gabriel Bovos up front. And then some first-team players on the bench here. So you can see Rooney's our top goal scorer with 18, Martial has 16, Memphis has 15. Interestingly enough, if we scroll down a bit, James Wilson, who's at Bournemouth at the minute, on loan, has got 15 goals as well in 30 games. So pretty good going for James Wilson. He may be able to come in and play a couple of games next season in the first team, hopefully. So I will join you in the match, guys. Okay guys, we're underway at Villa Park, we kick off, we're in the white and red there in the per the claret and blue. Yanazai straight away, crosses it and loses the ball. So it's a pretty young team, probably the youngest team we've played this season. Aston Villa currently 19th in the league if I have a look. 26 points this season. We are currently 6 points clear ahead of Man City. Clear of Man City. They've gone ahead against West Brom. So we kind of need to go ahead, lads. So, let's demand more. Um, we're not doing anything. 
Can we please do something? Um, let's... Okay, that's not done anything yet. I don't like having empty first halves. Damian picks up another yellow card. He likes to do that. Um, get creative. Come on, lads. Do something. It's Aston Villa, the second bomb in the league. We need this win to maintain a good lead at the top of the table. Man City now two ahead. Yanazai over to Gabriel Barbosa. Gabriel Barbosa going to get across into Lingard. To Zivkovic. Zivkovic, can he shoot? He shoots, but it's deflected out of number 23. I didn't see who it was. Zivkovic crosses in. Nothing happens. Zivkovic, no. Vertau gets it. Zivkovic intercepts, though. Zivkovic out to Damian. Through to Zivkovic again. Nothing happened. Okay, lads. I'm going to get aggressive at half time. That wasn't good enough, lads. Um. Come on, lads. We need more cutting edge in the second half. We need some finishes. We've had four shots, zero on target. So we've just played a Manchester United first half where we don't get shot on target in the first half. Rojo gets a yellow card in the first minute of the second half. Good start. Right, if it gets to 60, then I'm just going to bring on three subs, probably. I've tried to play youth. It hasn't worked, it seems. Zivkovic. Zivkovic scores! It might be an own goal. Zivkovic gets his fourth goal this season. That's pre-poor return, because I think he's played like 15 or 16 games total. I mean, the majority of them have been off the bench, so maybe consider it like... 8 or 9, and then 4 goals, that's pretty good. So, 1 and 2 from a winger. Yeah, that's a decent return. Okay, Diakite. Good header down, but didn't go to anyone on our team. Diego Reyes intercepts. Gabriel's got it. Gabriel gets tackled by Vertu. He's going off. It's nice to see someone not playing for our team get a red card. That doesn't often happen. They had just made a substitution as well. Kind of sucks for them. Shaw to Diego Reyes. To Shaw to Diakite. To Lingard. Out to Zivkovic on the right. He's been instrumental in this game, it seems. Out to Shaw on the left. Shaw crosses in. Gabriel gets blocked. Diakite. Lingard. Damian. Zuccolini, Damian, Yanazai, Yanazai, can you get across him? He gets across him. Lingard, you should be scoring that. I've just thought it would probably be better to have Zuccolini on that side since Shaw likes to run up and Damian doesn't like to run up that much. Zivkovic gets tackled. Now they can break. They don't though. It's been a pretty action-packed second half after that first half display. So we're going to be 8 points clear at this rate. There's 7 games to go. Let's say 5 points clear. If we can hold on and I'll be very happy. Right, come on. Get some interceptions going. Okay, why we got so many players forward? Right, they shot from like 25 yards. That's okay. I'm pretty sure Timo Horn likes to play as a sweeper cue as well, and I have him set to that. Yeah, he didn't come out then. I'm glad he didn't. It was a great decision not to, but... what are we? Why are we doing first touch passes? Okay, it worked, but... I was getting a bit worried that we were just going to keep giving the ball away. Lingard hits the bar. They're clear. I think in the 70th minute, I will bring on some players.
They're making their third substitution. Brought on Kozak to replace. Right, to replace Agbon Lahore. I'm going to take off Barbosa, bring on Anthony Martial. I'm going to bring on Memphis for Lingard and then swap Yanazai and Memphis around. Play Yanazai as a Trek Artista, that's his best position. Memphis is going to play as an inside forward on support. So Yanazai best on attack, it's only available on attack. Um, we'll swap Zuccolini, Zuccolini and Diakite around. For him as a box box midfield box box midfielder on support and for him as a all winning midfielder on either just support. Actually let's put it on defend since Shaw likes to run forward. And I think that'll be it for now. Faith in you Faith in you. Just want to get some young guns playing, even the substitutes are like twenty year olds. So Hopefully we can t maintain this win. Right. Marcos Rojo. To Memphis. To Diakite. Gives it away. But Yemazai intercepts. Zivkovic. Out to Shaw on the left. Shaw, can you go ball in here? To Memphis. To Shaw. Nice build up play. Shaw crosses in. Zivkovic scores. That's two for Zivkovic. Great goal. Fifth goal of the season for Zivkovic. In a second, I want to check how, yeah, how many goals exactly, or how many games exactly has played. Martial almost tapped it in, but Zivkovic was there to clear it up. Good goal by Zivkovic. Let's just check how many games has he played. He's played 23 games total, 11 starts, 12 sub appearances. So if we count the sub appearances as maybe 20, 30 minutes, so he's probably played four sub appearances there. So that's 15 total. So he's getting a goal every three games, so it's not as good as I thought, but seven assists as well. So he's been a pretty good player. Definitely worth the money, especially since he's still very young. So we're turning it up now. Should have the game wrapped up. As long as we don't concede here. I'm actually going to make sure we don't. Calm. Just tying up, lads. Just don't let them score. Zuccolini's just got sent off. Why? Why do we have to have a player send off in like every other match? Okay, well, Zivkovic can stay on because he's on his hat trick. Let's move Yanazai back and then let's bring on Fellaini. Actually, let's bring on Phil Jones and then let's play five of the back. And let's bring him back one as well. So a very defensive formation at this point. Just calm. Just pressures off. Go out there, play your natural game. Just don't concede. We've actually pulled back the goal difference. It's definitely between us and Man City at this point. For the title. Newcastle jumping above Arsenal in the Premier League. Swansea in 8th and have negative goal difference. We win 2-0. Good win for the boys. Zuccolini, why did you have to get sent off? Um, congrats, lads. Um... Disappointed in you getting sent off. I don't care, he's not going to play it very much. He might in the end of season run, run in, but depends if we clinch the title quite early or if not. Alright, I'm going to. I'm finding weak wages. I don't care. Well, it wasn't unfair because I gave it to Jones. And he's played much better this season than you. Okay, initial budgets for the transfer window. 4.6 million tran um, wage budget and 90 million transfer budget. So what's our current wage budget? Oh no, this is what it's been increased to. 
Very nice. We're currently spending three million, so we've got like one point five million wage, ninety million transfer budget. So if you guys have any suggestions for summer transfers, leave them down in the comment section below. Like the video if you've liked this episode. I know we're we'll now in the Champions League. Hopefully we can win it next season. Um, subscribe if you want to see more episodes of this. And from me, Corvus95, I hope you have a good rest of the week. I will see you again next time. Goodbye.